Yuji Itadori has evolved significantly throughout the series. In the Culling Game arc, he has acquired five notable abilities, some still in development while others fully mastered. Here are five abilities Yuji Itadori gained in the Culling Game arc. Yuji's acquisition of the Reverse Curse technique in the Culling Game arc showcased his exceptional skill in manipulating cursed energy. Despite being considered an advanced ability, Yuji mastered it within a month, reflecting his natural talent. This power enabled him to heal from dangerous attacks, including the lethal dismantle technique at point-blank range. Sukuna acknowledged Yuji's resilience and mastery over the reverse curse technique, highlighting his impressive control and adaptability in combat. Yuji possesses the innate ability to damage souls, a trait that has made him a formidable adversary, particularly feared by Mahito. While the mechanics of this ability remain a mystery to fans, it has consistently been a cause for concern among his enemies. In the Culling Game arc, Yuji's capacity to harm souls has evolved significantly. He can now directly target and damage even powerful entities like Sukuna, disrupting their cursed energy output and weakening their control over their host bodies. This makes Yuji's soul-damaging ability one of his most lethal techniques capable of profoundly affecting adversaries with just a single strike. In the Culling Game arc, Yuji Itadori showcases his acquisition of powerful abilities, including Supernova. This technique, associated with the Blood Manipulation Curse technique, allows users to remotely cause their blood to explode, creating smaller particles that pierce targets' bodies. Notably used by characters like Choso and Kamo, Yuji demonstrates his mastery of Supernova by employing it against Sukuna. After spitting blood on Sukuna's face, Yuji detonates it from a distance, inflicting significant damage on his opponent. This highlights Yuji's growing proficiency in combat and his ability to harness dangerous techniques to confront formidable adversaries like Sukuna. Piercing Blood stands as one of Yuji's formidable techniques, representing the pinnacle of blood manipulation abilities. Aside from a yet unseen domain expansion, this technique involves the user shooting a thin stream of blood generated by bringing their palms together at the speed of sound. Its devastating power allows it to pierce nearly anything, inflicting lethal damage upon impact. While fans have witnessed this technique in action, particularly during Yuji's confrontation with Sukuna, his face was not visible during its use. Despite initial speculation that it was Choso who employed the technique, it is highly likely that Yuji wielded this incredible power in his attempt to strike Sukuna from a distance. In the Culling Game arc, Yuji undergoes a notable transformation, sporting sharp claws and a mysterious red surface coating on his arms. While the exact nature of these arms remains undisclosed to fans, they seem to be linked to his ability to manipulate blood or souls. Despite lacking explanation from the author, it's evident that Yuji's strength is continually evolving, with these arms playing a pivotal role in his growth. Their potency is highlighted by their ability to profoundly affect even formidable entities like Sukuna, suggesting a possible amalgamation of Yuji's newly acquired powers. As the series progresses, Yuji's development and the true nature of his enigmatic arms remain subjects of intrigue among fans.